We're here today with Suzanne Jackson, beauty blogger extraordinaire turned businesswoman. She's our guest editor today. So Suzanne, thank you so much for coming in and welcome to Evoke. Thank you for having me. Everyone knows you primarily as a blogger, um, but more recently you've moved into the world of beauty. Is that Was that a conscious decision? So I started off as a blogger, obviously, and then because I come from a beauty background, I used to do a lot of beauty reviews on Sosumi. And they would always do very well and products would sell out from that. So it was kind of always in my head that I would love to do something beauty related for myself like a beauty line eventually and the readers kind of really gave me that push they used to always say oh wouldn't it be amazing if you had your own beauty product or your own makeup palette and so on so that's kind of where the idea kind of came about but it was very very organic and how everything happened. Obviously you're huge on social media do you find it difficult trying to maybe strike the balance by between having a private life and also then obviously providing all this content to your audience on a daily basis? And there always will be that I suppose battle for all bloggers but because I based my my blog originally around personal information and oversharing about my life and my dogs and Dylan and my engagement I don't think I could ever pull back from that but there is obviously a line and there is you know stuff I do share and stuff I choose not to share so for example if I have a blazing row with Dylan one day or I'm having a really off day or I'm having a really crap week I'm not going to write about that per se because no one wants to know about it. Where do you see yourself going in the next maybe five years? You know, it's funny, everybody always says to me, oh, I bet you had all this planned out over the last six years and you, you're, you're real business minded and stuff. And I'm kind of sitting there going, no, I've just pretty much just gone with the flow and, you know, everything's happened organically. So I'm not one of them people who sits down and goes, where do I want to be in five, ten years? All I know is I definitely want to be happily married with a family and um, with a good career and, um, you know, still developing product because that's my passion, still blogging because I even say to the readers when I'm blogging, I'll, I'll be 90 and still blogging because I did it before it was even a business and before I was earning a penny and I did it for many years not earning a penny from it um, but I don't have any major plans I just know I want to be very successful I want to have um, a good family and my health. Well I've no doubt that's all going to come true and thank you so much again for coming in and uh, we've really thank enjoyed you. having you as guest editor Thanks today. Thanks very much for having me.